Hello Internet, how's it going? This is Masnoel Nasiki, your uh, Sudanese third world rock star from Baltimore, Maryland. And uh, I'm here today to make another vegan dish. Uh, I know it's been a while since, since I made one uh, for the Vegan Muses blog. And uh, I've been posting pictures, but uh, it's because uh, I was hungry at that time. <laughs> and I actually didn't have the time to actually make a video. But uh, today, um, I'm yet going to be experimenting with... Um, a crazy recipe that I thought up on, on the spot sometimes. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a dish using some kale, some spinach, and oven roasted tofurkey. So um, I have no idea what's going to happen, but uh, I guess that's why it's such an adventure. So. Let's see what we're gonna do. Uh, it should be fun. It should be a lot of fun. All right. So, what I've done now is uh, I basically I've cut up the uh, the tofurkey and I've set aside the um, the kale and the spinach um, so that I would actually I'm planning to to cook this. I'm gonna serenade this. Uh, serenade. That's not even the right. Sautéed. Sorry, I'm a musician, so I tend to use a lot of musical vocabulary. So I'm going to be sautéing, and I guess the music is also serenading. So yes, I'm going to be having a serenaded kale today. That's going to be fun. So here's uh, here's what everything kind of looks like. Here's the kale. Here's the spinach. This is the cut up tofurkey. And this is like a whole bunch of different things that I'm planning to use. Um, yes, and there is raisins. Um, because I figured since I'm planning to use soy and kale is also like a little bitter tasting. So I figured throwing in some, some raisins. Uh, might sweeten up the deal a little bit. So uh, yeah, I have some olive oil right now in the pan, so um, let's go do that. So now that the um, the olive oil is uh, is nice and heated up, I'm gonna start throwing in some some of the kale in there. Throw in some of the spinach. So this and the rest of the spinach. So by doing this it actually they start almost shrinking a little bit, which is cool because that way there's more room. To, to add in the rest of the things that I want to add, which is great. Now, to kind of give you an idea of how everything is looking right now. This is how everything is looking. See, everything is kind of shrinking and they're all kind of coming together. So at this point, um, I will start adding some uh, some spices. I'm gonna start with a little bit of the all-purpose. This is like my best friend. I use this on almost everything. Some soy sauce. I like to use the cups for for measuring. I usually like put two. Some lemon. Also, I add just two two of those. And I'm gonna turn down the, the heat a little bit. I have to say, I. Did not expect everything <laughs> like the 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 shrink the shrinkage level of of these um, of the kale and the um, and the spinach is extremely high. I had no idea. So for all the amount that I just cooked, look how much of it is actually after it's cooked. It gets that that much. It's very small in a way. 
Um, so I guess that means now I've learned something that whenever I'm going to be cooking kale or basically heating up kale and whatnot, then I need to put larger amounts um, to get larger portions because this is definitely just a one a one portion type of deal. Um, so let's try it out. This is my first tasting of it. Let's see how this goes. Hopefully this goes well. So bon appetit. It's actually really good. I like it. So this makes me think because I was wondering if I was, I'm not even going to need to put the raisins. I was planning to, to add raisins to it because I was worried it might be a little too, too soury. But it's not, it's actually really, really good. So now I want to try it out by having, adding a little bit of horseradish to it and um, see how that works. I got this from the, um, what I call the vegan magic box uh, from uh, Vegan Cuts. They have these um, vegan starter kits where they send you a box full of all sorts of really cool goodies. So this is one of the things that was in there I was very excited about. But yeah, so I have to say, that took me like about, what, 50 minutes to, to do. And um, it was very easy, very simple, and um, came out really good. I like this. I think this would be more of a, of a side dish than an actual dish, especially with this with this portion. Um, so I would totally recommend this as a, a unique tofurkey kale spinach salad, I guess, uh, next to, you know, whatever dish you're gonna have, so. But it's cool, I like it, I like it. Yes, more successes, I love it, I love it, I love it. This is a good sign. Each, with each video, it's getting better, so this is awesome. So uh, thank you very much for watching. Uh, please make sure to visit the, the blog, which is uh, veganmuses.blogspot.com. And also make sure to go and support the uh, Vegan Living Program, especially if you're in Baltimore. Uh, they're doing some great work. Uh, the website is uh, veganlivingprogram.org. So make sure to go there and, uh, and check them out. And uh, yeah, let me know in the comments if you've tried this or if you have some, uh, some improvements for, uh, for this uh, bachelor vegan cooker over here so yeah thank you very much hope you enjoyed it and i'll see you next time right peace